What's going on guys? It's Madman Plant. We are back in the lab for some trimming. Now I used to spend my days in trim jail. Now I spend them with the batch one go. Now this is made by Twisted Trimmers and this is a really cool tabletop trimmer that you can use in your home. This can do five pounds in one hour. We got two types of bud. We got our Southern, uh, no, not Southern, Strawberry Cadillac by Lovin' In Her Eyes, which came out really, really nice, really dense. It has gorgeous orange hairs to it, totally full of THC crystals all over, even the sugar leaves looking great. And then we had the Purple Magnolia by Lovin' In Her Eyes. Now this one, which I dropped a little bit of, this one came out a little bit larpy, and it's my fault. It got a little bit mutated along the way. It gave me the three fingers, the one finger. Um, but it still came out moi, and it smells amazing. And I love it, and it got stuck to my mask. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna avoid trim gel. Now what I did is I cured this in my can of troll, and I also used my cure puck. I have overflow problems, and I can't always fit everything. So both of them work perfect for curing. Now that I got this all ready to go, I've let it sit out for about an hour just to absorb a little bit more dry moisture. The Twisted Trimmer does amazing uh, when you have a drier consistency. You don't want to dry it out completely and ruin your chirpings, but you do want it. So a little air dry for an hour should do you good if you use a can of troll or something else. Now what we're going to do is obviously stop the machine real quick now the way this machine works is how it's designed is we tilt this back like so just like this and then we're going to go ahead and start loading the machine it's important to know that when you do this you want to remove all the stems because if you don't they're going to get caught up and it's going to make this horrible clanking noise and that's not how it's designed to use so we're just gonna go ahead and pick up the handfuls of this. Drop all of this in there. Okay, we keep those flavors separate. Next thing we're gonna do is put our lid on. Most important thing. Now I can fill it up more, but I'm gonna leave some spacing. Plus, I don't wanna mix up my weed. So, pop that down. We're gonna go ahead, tilt this back forward. Bam, like so. We're gonna push start. Now, as you can hear that clanky noise, that's the stem. So you gotta be extra careful. I'll go in there in a little bit and take those out. But as you can see, it's gonna start removing all of that extra, dropping it to the bottom, clean, ready for your edibles, ready for your tinctures, whatever you want to do with the excess. So it's looking pretty good. We'll give it about 15 minutes. We'll come back and see what it looks like. All right, guys. So the badge one go trimmer is a must for home growers. Now, I will tell you that my bud is a little bit moist from being in the can troll, that 0.6 water activity. So if you want a nice clean cut, you are gonna need to let your bud sit out just a little bit to get crisp enough so those leaves pop off. It uses that nylon grid that it rubs against with the casket. So that's what's clipping these off. So if it's too wet, it's not blade to blade. It's blade to that grid. So with that being said, you can see on the tops of these what it would look like if I had this perfectly dry. And it's in their recommendation. Mainly I needed to get it just trimmed for myself as I get more stuff ready. But I'm just so impressed and I love the quality, the simple ease of putting this in letting us do its thing and pulling it out and it's ready to go. The shape and the profile that this gives is so nice. It gives a perfect rounded edge where it is really nice, close, everything's evenly spaced. These nugs look perfect and this is what you're paying for is the beauty of having something that looks just like this in your own home. I really recommend Twister Trimmers. They are the best you should definitely pick one up. Guys, this is it. This is all I got for you this episode. We'll see you guys next time here at Madman Planet.